16 Marines from Camp Pendleton arrested on a variety of accusations ranging from human smuggling to drug related offenses. Good evening, I'm Steve Atkinson. And I'm Kimberly Hunt in for Lindsay Pena. 10 News reporter Rena Nakano joins us now from Camp Pendleton where the mass arrest took place very publicly this morning. Rena. Yeah, that's right. Uh, we are told that what these 16 Marines are accused of doing does not align with Marine Corps policy or values, and that is why they made an example of them today. A shocking wave of arrests coming out of Camp Pendleton Thursday morning. NCIS agents cuffed 16 Marines during battalion formation, an outdoor meeting in front of 800 people. I mean, the fact that these arrests were done at a battalion formation is the Marine Corps the command's way of saying, hey, this is not going to be condoned. If you're involved in this type of activity, this is what's going to happen to you. The 16 accused of having some sort of involvement in human smuggling and drug offenses, all stemming from a previous human smuggling case. 10 News told you earlier this month about a July 3rd arrest by Border Patrol. Agents arrested Marine Lance Corporal Byron Darnell Law Jr. and David Javier Salazar Quintero after seeing three undocumented immigrants jump into the Marines car in a remote area near Tecate. The two were interviewed by federal prosecutors. The two individuals that were previously arrested and are going through the federal district court system uh, provided information to investigators. The names and involvement of 16 others prompting this morning's arrest. Retired Marine and military lawyer Gary Barthel says it's sad that cartels are targeting young, underpaid military members to do their dirty work. The coyotes who are zeroing in on service members uh, to do these, these tasks for them, to do the smuggling. And a lot of the people that they're targeting that are in the military are young, inexperienced, um, and they don't get paid a lot. And the arrested Marines ranks range from E2 to E4 with salaries no more than $30,000. The 16 arrested, their names have not been identified. Reporting live at Camp Pendleton tonight, I'm Rena Nakano, 10 News. Rena, thank you.